Alright guys, this is my third fluster bucket video. Um, I visited my mom in Virginia Beach, Gunny Moriarty. We went through some stuff. Bear with me. See what we can do. The fluster bucket, it's a bucket of stuff. You put it together, you're creative, you make it happen. Thank you, Jesse Hutchinson and Sam Brownstanner. We'll see what happens. And David Welder, of course, gave us the idea. It's still not bad for consistency. Well, probably no better than standard basket re 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 as far as it being totally even. Yeah, and you don't have to soak this stuff. <laughs> nope. It didn't In cost anything thing. either. A hot tub. Because as soon as you figure you got enough process, you can turn your camera off to save batteries. Yeah, but then that wouldn't catch any kind of humorous stuff that might happen. Like cutting <laughs> like, your finger off. Like cutting your finger off and your mom screaming at you about bleeding on the garage floor, right? Yeah, exactly. Such a caring woman. <laughs> and she was a nurse. I made you what you are today, Slick. I think it's because you knew how to fix me and you just didn't want the carpets fucked up. You got it. That's why I spent 60 grand on a nursing degree. <laughs> 60 grand back in 1932 is a lot of fucking money, too, I'm telling you. You know, you're an <laughs> asshole. Flying on the floor. Wait a minute. Let's get That's, some of this, this shit. This is part of that desk. Okay. And you know, if you're really nice to me, I'll go into my antique key collection and probably get the key for those drawers. Which drawers? The drawers on your... In this thing? Yeah. You have them? Yeah. Normal people like tape them right inside the drawer. I mean, I understand keeping them safe somewhere. Did you see the cobwebs on that bear? Yeah, well... And besides, with you around, you'd take them and use them to make a, an antique Hawaiian hula skirt with or something. Well, it's a hamster ukulele, is what I was thinking, but... No, I just thought, I just assumed that the key was going out or whatever it might be, but... No, I've got a whole bag full of antique keys from various and assorted insane things from centuries back. So if you've got a huge bag of these keys, yeah. who's going to keep trying each one until they figure it out? <clears throat> the person that now owns it? <laughs> I didn't ask for it. I can, it. The door's open. I've got hammers. I can get it open again. Hey, hey, you're off, you're off. You're pushing, you're pushing it off here. You've got oh. to... Yeah, I'm, I'm doing okay down here. I just wanted to get started. Okay. Yeah, that first inch or so is a little hairy. But see, you're off. Look. You're all the way over here, and you're up on that side. <laughs> Pay attention. I'm off. <laughs> and who was I birthed from? It's genetics. Listen, I swear they switch kids in the hospital on me. Switch mothers on me. <laughs> yeah, but you were too young to complain about it. <laughs> There's a perfectly nice church lady out there somewhere missing a child. Yeah, nice church lady, sure. So you're saying I'm a product of my environment. You're really diving yourself out. Well, I was normal until I missed your father, so it's all his fault. And just for the record, you never taught me how to leg hump either. Hey, you do a split hand on the that's right. Yep. Okay. We're splitting hairs, someone. Okay. So it's my job to keep it relatively evenly on the post. Sounds good to me. It's a good thing we talked about it on our last three. Yeah. Well, when you write it up for the annals of history, you can make all the corrections you want. Now, you have to understand this about my group, Mom. If you make any kind of reference that's even remotely close to anything else, they're going to talk about how my mother talked about the annals of history. Well, I... <laughs> you've met your father, haven't There's you? There's assholes all over That's this place. That's right.
You know the difference between a married woman and a divorced woman, don't you? Mm, what? <laughs> the married woman only has one asshole. Mm. <laughs> How true it can be. See, I'm gonna do a number on you with this group. You already did a number on me. Have half you people met me? <laughs> Ask Ben Sowers. You know, I heard he was relatively normal once you left, or before you arrived, rather. Yeah, I think he needs therapy now. I was really hoping, because I played with a flashlight, that these would actually almost be a fiber optic kind of thing. Yeah. But for all the nerdy folks out there, I'm sure it, um, it's not that kind of material. But making the edges on these, that was the only part of the reason yeah, why I thought Yeah, they'll start to gleam. Yeah. I thought it would be really cool is if it was an eights, which we, you and I now know it's quite the task, but in eights you'd have a whole lot more of these yeah. edges and corners. But Well, I was thinking of saving some of it out and cutting circles mm -hmm. that were an eighth inch thick and scattering them over the finished surface so you'd have these round neon-like raw edges to look at. On, on the surfaces of like the top and the bottom? Or? No, on, on the exterior of the basket. Oh, I gotcha. We could hit with glitter just to make it all unicorny and shit. <laughs> so we got a lot. This is actually, yeah. I mean, I wasn't sure about the sizing, but I guess it's, you know, what's going to happen. I had a great time making this video. Feel free to do whatever you want to do. Comment, all that kind of stuff. It was still really fun, guys. So, I'm learning. Let me know how it's going.